Thank you for joining today's Hong Kong Rugby Football Union National Sevens Team Announcement Press Conference. On behalf of all my colleagues at HSBC, I would like to wish both teams the very best of luck for the tournament and for a wonderful Hong Kong Sevens team. I'm very pleased to report that our teams have not let us down and have achieved significant success. Definitely. We were ecstatic when we found out that it's gone to IRB and that they're going to put the finals in, in the Hong Kong Stadium. We thought that was amazing. So we were really excited about that and very happy about the competition going to IRB. There's a lot of um, really tough teams that we're going to be facing. There isn't really an easy match or an easy pool. And it, it's going to be really tough for us and trying to finish in a, in a top placement for us. So that's where it brings, brings a big challenge for Hong Kong. Uh, feels really good. It's an honour to uh, to lead the team, but um, the guys we've got in the squad, the 12 guys we have, and actually the extended squad as well, know each other pretty well. So thankfully, there's not much work to be done in terms of leading. Or I, I want to try and help Hong Kong to become as successful as possible. So I expect myself, and I'm a, you know top tournament, uh, obviously do my role in the team, and, uh, if we all do our roles then obviously the team will come out, come out on top. The support of the audience is our strength. Because every audience and high support of the audience is very happy and very hard to make Hong Kong The final selection of this year's squad was probably the toughest decisions I've ever had to make as a coach, not just in Hong Kong, but um, when, with my time when I was working with the Welsh 7 squad. Uh, the competition for places has been tough. Um, we've probably got 20 athletes now that compete, could compete on the Asian series and at the top end of the IRB, um, Hong Kong 7. So, yeah, selection was tough and we were able to make calls if people weren't particularly um, 100% fit or had to miss training phases because of work. We were pretty clinical this year and uh, hence the, the 12 that are going into the competition are, are well prepared.